Hi guys, my name is Zen and this is Maybe Bonsai. Um, today I am ready to go to the Bonsai Zone uh, to Nigel Saunders' place and uh, I'm bringing over a few plants to uh, you know let him help me to do some pruning and maybe some styling. So I'll show you what those are. So this ficus, um, this I took it over last year in uh, around the same time in December sometime. So I'm taking it back to him and uh, we'll have a pruning at that. And then I'm also taking the big jade over because this thing has grown a lot. I'm not too sure what to do with this, so hopefully he'll know better. And I'm also taking over the pomegranate. Uh, it doesn't have any leaves right now, but I uh, also pruned this at his place last time. So we'll continue to, continue to do that this time as well. So I'm all, all, put, all packed. I uh, have some soil here and there's a pot in there as well. Um, maybe we can repot the ficus because it definitely needs it. So uh, we'll get on our way and uh, I'll see you when I get there. Hi guys, I uh, arrived at the bonsai zone with Nigel. <laughs> it's quite warm in the, uh, in the new greenhouse, I guess. And um, we're gonna start here, get to work on the three trees. So me and Nigel looked at this tree um, this is the, the big jade, it's a cutting, and uh, we talked about it for a while, for about 15 to 20 minutes, and what we decided is that to make a big cut right over here, and hope for some, uh, some branches coming out either on this ring or underneath, that is, uh, that's going to make this a lot shorter, and it won't make it, it won't look like this house plant kind of a tree thing, this jade is just, it's too tall. And I need to take it back. So it's gonna, you know, it's, it's a huge cut, but the top part I could keep as a cutting. And then this part, I might take another cutting so I could have a kind of a three tree forest in the future. So also this was a cutting from Connor. And currently I don't know how deep this is plenty in the pot. And, uh, you know, knowing it's a cutting, it's probably deeper than, you know, shallower. So yeah, that's something that I have to take care of in the future. Um, but for now, we're just gonna do the cut and hope for the best. So we've got the bypass pruners. Uh, sure. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know what they're called, but it's yeah. The biggest tool we have to reach around that trunk. Yeah. Okay, so let's see if I can get this around. So you see, we'll have to cut in. Right, I can cut You're in. filming right, Zen? Yeah. Okay, so there's the initial cut. I'm just having trouble kind of getting this in. Yeah, I can hold the top here so it doesn't fall down. I'm going to have to push this in more. Yeah. There okay. you go. That looks good. Okay. okay, so this this might be the cut here. <laughs> yeah, this is it. Oh, just like that, eh? Wow. That's a nice size, isn't it, for a cutting? There's a new shoot. We were <laughs> Just coming out here? Yeah. Wow. Um, I'm going to reduce this. I just, okay. this is just, this thing especially, I'm going to yeah, take yeah. it off. Yeah. Put that uh, cutting back. Then you got even more. You can create a, a 12 or 13 tree <laughs> forest now. No, 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 that's too many. <laughs> uh, this will leave for now and I'll take care of that when I, when okay. I get home. So, yeah, this is, you know, it's quite light. Oh, that's now. awesome. Well, there's the hard work done. Now we've got to do a little more pruning, right? Yeah. Okay. Right. Turn table. <laughs> um, so this one we talked about, we're going to get rid of. Yeah. Right. That lowest branch. Yeah, we just kind of thought it was strange. It's okay. a nice branch, but it's just we don't need it. We want to have a trunk, don't we? Yeah. We want it to look like a bush. Okay. So, so that's going to come off too. I've got some branch pruners in too. Yeah, I'll try that. I guess it'll work. Wow, that looks good, eh? Can't even see there was a branch there. Yeah, that'll be fine. That'll heal. Yeah. And then... Now, I would cut that other one back. We want to keep it, but I would probably go back. Right here? Just there? Okay. Yeah. Because you've got two branches there already. 
I'll just take it back a little bit more. Okay. Should be okay. Yeah, I would say that's about all we can do on this one, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> now you have a lot of little um, yeah shoots coming up in the soil there. Um, I don't know if they're we don't know if they're leaves or if they're coming up from yeah. probably our leaves, aren't they? These are I think our leaf cuttings. They just uh, yeah. sprout of themselves. Um, this one's a little close to the trunk. It could be a branch. That one. The one. This one could be a branch because yeah. it's like right. Actually, I think it is a branch. <laughs> yeah, I think it is too. It looks like it's yeah. coming right off the trunk. It's okay. These, uh, I'll I'll take care of uh, when yeah. you know whenever I repot this. Yeah. But yeah. So yeah, that's a big uh, big step. Yeah, it sure makes the trunk look thicker, doesn't it? Yes, it does. <laughs> <laughs> Which is what you want. You want the trunk to look really impressive. Yeah. Yeah, that's going to be nice. I, I think. Once it starts filling out, it, it's going to look really, really good. Yeah, I'll cross my fingers and we'll get stuff over here. Yeah, just <laughs> give it good light, warmth, and that's all you can do. Yeah. Awesome. Okay. Okay. All right, so we're back from lunch. We had an enjoyable lunch, and uh, we had a good look at this tree. We talked about what, what needs to be done. And the main thing is that there's a lot of these uh, crossing branches inside. You can see there's one that forms an X. That's my X. initial <laughs> it's in the tree. Yeah. Um, in. <laughs> so there's this, lots of these vertical runs. This is the pomegranate. Yeah, the pomegranate. Yeah. Um, we pruned last uh, this year, this summer. Yeah, yeah. so this was um, pruned on my birthday, wasn't it? Yeah. Yeah, and then we had that big birthday surprise. and <laughs> <laughs> Very memorable. <laughs> yes, yeah. That's um, cool. The other problem that we discovered, well, not a problem, but, you know, is that the, the cuts that I made before, I believe I made these cuts, um, the the wood here kind of died back, so this is all dead wood. This is dead wood. There's you know, kind of the barks are peeling off. Yeah. Um, and then eventually we I think I'll have to eventually cut, carve this a bit so it makes it look more natural. But um, over time, this trunk, the bark should eventually roll over and it'll look okay. Might make a good feature. That yeah. might become the front someday. Yeah, you, you never know. know. Wow, is that ever cool? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So those are the pro the pro the bigger problems, and then another thing that we were talking about is this secondary leader here that are that is uh, way too strong. Yeah. Um, it's very straight. It's thick. Plus, there's this weird branch coming out here. It, the direction of it just uh, doesn't really work. Right. Um, so we're thinking about taking that off, and uh, you know, this will also kind of make create a more separation between this branch and this branch like as the height yeah, yeah. as the tree gets older though it kind of blend in so yeah they might look like kind of bar branches yeah. in the future eh? and we want to avoid that you know now so that we'll have to deal with it later yeah yeah so okay. yeah those are the uh, the main points and then we'll have to see where it, where it goes after that well that sounds good zen all right all right so we're gonna start the pruning and uh, I'm going to start with the obvious smaller branches that are verticals and that are crossing branches. Um, this will make more room to prune for the other ones. So first off, this one here. It's very obvious, so I'm going to cut this off. And then I'm going to give her the X in the middle of the tree here, right there. <laughs> uh, okay, I have to kind of get in here. Just spin this around. She was trying to spell your name. Yeah. It's just appreciating its owner, right? Exactly. <laughs> and then uh, here, there's this here. Um, this one here as well. Nice fine branching on these, aren't they? They're nice trees. Yes, the pomegranate very. It grows fast and. Uh, Okay, can't get this off. There we go. It's <laughs> more worse. Mm -hmm. Can I clean this up a bit? Yeah. And also this here. Uh, so I'm not going to do anything with this because I'm going to take it off at yeah, the bottom there. Right yeah. Off, yeah. This one needs to go right like this. That's way, way in there. I 
think so, or pruned back at least. Oh, let me try going back. Mm. The uh, from what I can tell, the buds are going on this side, mm -hmm. and then the opposite side. So if it grows towards this side, it still will be a kind of a yeah strange thing. I, I, I probably better to remove it. Eh? Yeah, I think well, so. We were gonna take were we gonna take the whole top off that branch? Oh right, yeah. right from here. So, so I wouldn't yeah, have to worry that'll about that'll all it. be gone anyway, won't it? Yeah. Yeah, uh, remember that now. <laughs> okay, so I'll leave that for now then, because okay. we'll just take that whole thing off. Yeah, that maybe we should off. maybe we should do those two big cuts first. First, eh? yeah, okay. Because that yeah. might determine what's going on with the other branching. Sure. So I mean, it's cleaned up quite a bit now, so let's uh, switch. That it should work, eh? The, that tool. Yeah, this should work. Okay. Uh, let's start. And we'll start with the smaller one. <laughs> yeah, I I would leave much of a stub as you can for Let's dieback to clean this up first based on those other branches where it looks like we right I think I do tend to die back a bit don't they yeah I have to approach from the other side like yeah. this it's not a lot of room it's gone. there it goes that should be good yeah just let that it's probably a little closer than I like but I think it will be okay I think it'll be okay it looks like that this branch is pretty strong coming off it isn't it yeah I mean we have this branch here to draw some sap so I think yeah yeah mm -hmm. even if the inside of that branch died off it would heal itself yeah in these cases you know I cut it off there's really nothing on this side it's just you know yeah okay so that's and then the, there's a bigger cut yeah <laughs> this one I'll take in steps. I'll, I'll first take okay. it off here first. Does it, you know, this would be a big cut. Oh, done. Just like that. It's not about cutting. That is a good cutting. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so now, and you were saying to leave a stub as well, right? I would, yeah. So somewhere around that area, would you say? Yeah, I would say you'd want uh, two or three millimeters. Yeah. At minimum. And then we can seal it too. Okay, here we go. Big, okay, there's another big cut. Oh, just like that. So how does it look now? Let's have a look. Well, let's see. Okay, so our front. I like it better. Yeah, it does open up the tree a lot. Yeah, and it, it makes the trunk stand out now, doesn't it? Right. And, and then this, I can utilize that in the back eventually. Yeah. Um, or were you thinking of getting rid of that? Because there's nothing it, it, it's running parallel with the trunk line that's the only trouble well i was thinking but, we cut it back yeah and then there's a button on the, on the uh going kind of towards the right the yeah. back to the towards the right i guess it depends where your exact front is right i mean with um, that branch gone we can kind of change the front yeah like yeah that 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 view you had there was okay too That opens up a whole <laughs> whole new bunch of possibilities, doesn't it? <laughs> yeah. So it must be a right decision to remove that because now there's, you know. My my opinion is that I think you've already got enough thick stuff, branches coming off this branch on here. Mm -hmm. Is that if you want something on the back of the tree, it should be something uh, yes. coming off the main trunk, filling it out, not right. another branch at this junction. Is right is what I'm thinking. I can I can um, see this this view. Hope I'm in the oh, right. Oh yeah, part. that's nice. This view, in this view, then I don't need that back branch. I already have the back there. Right. And then you have the kind of the front's coming towards us, which is what we want. Um. I guess the only the only caveat is is that the trunk seems wider in this view mm -hmm. versus. Yeah, I think here? the trunk's nicer in the other view. Yeah, but the branching looks nice. I think nicer yeah. in this view. <laughs> it's staggered better, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, it, it just looks really uh, nicely structured. Yeah. Uh, well, but it's good to have options. Like, um, you know, maybe this view will 
increase get better and better in the future maybe that is a good view it is it looks good yeah i think you've got you've got the deadwood down here mm -hmm. in that view which I mean, you have to imagine that not there and then it wouldn't right. look so good but uh or you know once it heals over eventually you know yeah yeah but it i mean it's okay we, we can i mean right now we're pruning it's not gonna it's not gonna matter which is the front yeah maybe that's a decision for another day yes yeah. uh, which because now we have this possibility and then the regular this yeah which also looks pretty good too <laughs> yeah, it does, yeah. yeah i i think you know you've got this branch this one this one this one it's got good staggering in this view it's coming forward slightly yeah yeah i, I think i still okay I, I think i'd take that one off just yeah. because it's growing too close to the trunk and you've already got branches that come out down low there yeah I think there's a and then i think yeah i think you've got to fill in that space right right something from off of here yeah which you have you've got this branch and not I much mean, once else this is starts there. growing we'll kind of fill that space a little yeah even yeah yeah it's a bit of a maybe there's nothing yeah I'm going to say maybe there's nothing going on that side because the trunk because line's kind of that. dead but right. but this one is that one is yeah okay so well yeah let's get rid of that yeah I, I think it, it looks like it's growing like from the v of the branch anyway it's yeah. just not in a good position in my opinion <laughs> gone uh you know what i'll i'll let it heal and uh, okay. clean it yeah i just i can i kind of lost some trust with the tree <laughs> yeah it looks like it needs a bit of room for dieback doesn't yeah, it yeah for sure okay so the rest i guess we we'll just uh shorten the back i think so okay so uh we spent a few minutes to look at the structure of the tree to kind of reevaluate and uh, we were talking about these two branches here these two coming off the, uh, the, the the trunk. It's quite a short distance between the trunk and the branch and then where it divides. Yeah, we're wondering if it divides too early into from one branch to two. Or yeah, maybe. and the, just the, this part is so short that your future branches needs to be, you know, proportional to that, which means it's gotta be smaller than this. Yeah. Maybe a centimeter of space. Yeah. And which, that might not work. <laughs> right, it's getting small very quickly. Yeah. Each branch should get a little shorter the subdivision before the next mm -hmm. bifurcation. But uh, and then the next thing we we'll discuss is that which one to take off. <laughs> yeah, if we simplify it back to one, which right. one? So let's go back to this view around there. I think it's a is a, is a possible front. Yeah. If we take this back, That's you know, it, it looks, looks like it. To me, it looks pretty decent because you got the left side you got the right side it's yep. kind of bounces out yeah and the other option was taking this off and, and then you have to shorten this a bit back one so you kind of get kind of the same structure but this one's more upright uh maybe around there somewhere somewhere around this area you have to use your imagination <laughs> which i'm kind of leaning towards <laughs> taking the back one off but um <laughs> Yeah. yeah my my initial thought was that once i did this you know it just it looked quite good didn't it yeah and that, that was already got it's so it's so me <laughs> this is smaller t thinner and you've got subdivision there already yeah um so we talked maybe shortening the back one and then having another look at it yeah we could try that so yeah i think that's what we'll do because the back one will, will get shortened anyway yeah so we can do that first and then take a take look, a look and, and take a look again so yeah. i'll shorten this to here for now okay okay so and then we look at it and the one the one that's forward is more spreading isn't it yeah this you know kind of spreads a uh, nice, nice angle. To me, it kind of matches more the style of the branch on the right-hand side. Yeah. Do you think? Or? I think so. I I like the uh, the front one 
better from okay. the from the so do I. From the, okay. <laughs> Let's <laughs> take the back one off then. Okay, good, perfect. <laughs> you'll have to leave another stump on it there. Yeah. Uh, a bit oh, for die back in. Eh? Small. So here we here you go. This is okay. Big so decisions for this tree today. Oh, that's there it goes. Off. Flying okay. branches. Wow. That that stump is looking really good, the trunk on this. Like um I think you know that deadwood is once that sort of grows around here, it's gonna look really nice. You're gonna get a lot of character on this trunk. Yeah, lots of character. Lots That'll of character. Cool. That'll be cool. <laughs> in time. Yeah, in time. It'll okay. Um, that's the way this should come off, right? This is yeah. kind of yeah. going inside. Yeah, we will clean this up. We'll clean that. Okay. All right, shall we move on to the rest? Just shrubbing yeah, stuff? Yeah. Okay. Um, I guess we'll start with the top. Okay. Now, we were we were looking at this leader here. Yeah. Uh, it is the thickness. There's a bit of taper, which is okay, but it's quite straight to here. But we were thinking of cutting this. Now hopefully, uh, there's a bud in the front here. Right. And then there is potentially a bite in the back. I mean, there is a there is a leaf bite in the back as well, so going towards like that direction. Yeah, yeah. And then we were talking about taking off right there, and hopefully like, we can get and that couple of branches coming out. What do you think? Um, just look. At, I, I'm looking at this <laughs> branch here. Uh, well, that'll probably get shortened, I think. Yeah. Yeah, I think this part coming out the front has to come off, and maybe, maybe just keep the two out the back. Do you think? Something like that. Two out the back. Or maybe just even the one. Or. Yeah. I'm not sure. Uh, this yeah, this this should this should come off because this is uh, like a bit of poker, poker, isn't yeah, it? <laughs> it's coming coming out as an angle. Try try taking that off first. Okay. And leave a bit of a room for die back and. And we'll look at it. Like yeah, that looks looking better, isn't it? I'm just wondering about this branch conflicting with the yeah. one below. I was looking at that too. Uh, it it's not horrible, but I think it's going to become a problem. <laughs> that's not, that's is what not, I'm thinking. It's not horrible, but it's not good either. <laughs> <laughs> um, you know what I mean? There's like yeah. two branches no, I, coming I, out. I definitely see your point there because they're just overlapping a little bit. Oh, oh, yeah, so I can I can you take that off. Right? This just the angle of the of the branch is just like going kind of back into the tree a little bit. Okay, why don't I take this off first? And then uh, you can have a better look. You're taking which off? The, yeah, the small one. This one, are you? Were you it, it, I'm assuming that's the one you were referring to, or are you referring to the top one? I, I was talking about the relationship between this branch and this branch. Oh, the the, the big ones. Okay. Um, yeah. Let's see how it they're running kind of parallel with each other. Yeah. And yeah. It, it could go. Um, Okay, so if that goes right, and then we prune this back, we'll get more branching in this area. Yeah, I was thinking. I think one of these might have to go. Uh -huh. <laughs> it could be the bottom one, keep the top one, right? Which would help our bar branch situation, even though this is a really nice branch. Or the top one could go, or we could keep them. <laughs> Let's think about that then. Okay. <laughs> Have a look at it and see what you think. Um, yeah. Tough decision. Do you see the problem there? That I, I do. I do. Yeah. And I think it looks okay now, but I think that's going to become. It's going to bug you more and more into the future. Yeah. Is that you're going to see that, and then you're going to. Initially. Now, now I, I don't know this and this. Is there rotating the front? Does it solve it? Maybe. Um, So definitely it doesn't get any better in this view, does it? It's no, kind they're, of, they're just... This view it does similar. if this was kind of the leader of the tree. If 
you don't want to take it back that far. <laughs> <laughs> the tree's getting smaller in a minute. <laughs> yeah, I know. It'd be a super tiny tree. Uh, um, that's one possible solution is to keep this as your leader and take this off, but then your leader's really coming forward. Right. It's not the, probably the best solution. If you prune this off, you've lost a good mature branch and then you're left with the two lower branches which kind of look more like bar branches then don't they yeah because this i mean the the direction of the two buds here we can't it just doesn't this yeah. one goes down that one goes into the trunk into the the main the main trunk if you take this one off it solves all our problems but it's a nice branch yeah <laughs> i was i kind of want to keep that i know but it sure solves the It problems. does solve the problem. <laughs> <laughs> Unfortunately. It's a problem solver to take it off. I know. I, I hate when you have to do this with trees. It's like... I mean, it's got a decent flow line. It's going, you know, in, in the right direction. Yeah, it, it's, not, it's not the perfect branch because it's coming off the front of the tree unless you rotate it a bit, mm -hmm. which you can easily do then if that wasn't there. Yeah. That, that, and then that you've got... Work. That oh, sucks. Okay. <laughs> I, I'm going to stop the camera and we're going to think about it. Okay, yes, let's do that. All right, so another uh, 10 to 15 minutes of discussion of <laughs> what to do with this. And uh, the possible outcomes is that one, we take this off yeah. and we kind of rotate the tree so this becomes more to the side, yeah. you know, which, which will work. Um, the other is basically taking this off and leaving the leader as is, and you have the two side branches. Yeah. Um, and then the f and another one that I was thinking about is taking this entire thing off, the leader, and then rotating the tree so that this That's branch, new leader that my I new leader, that comes kind of towards us, and I would take this branch here as my basically the uh, future leader. Yeah. And then, you know, there's a bud there. I'm hoping that'll come off, and then we get some... Uh, movement and taper in the in the main trunk and you were going to rotate that this bar branch to yeah, the back to the so back it, so it would be something like so you like don't there, see right? it anymore it's kind of yeah. a back branch and it and keep in mind this will get cut off eventually so that, yeah that's just stopped. pretend that's not there <laughs> I, I think that looks good i think i even think you know it shows the deadwood in this view but i think that's going to become uh, like a really nice future, future in the future yeah. because you have a hollow kind of spot there right and it's going to look really good, I think. Yeah. Okay. The only danger is that <laughs> if it does... No, you've got life here. So I don't think it's ever going to look like an undercut. Yeah. That's what you oh, don't okay. want. Right. You want some live tissue back here. And I think you have that, right? You've got this live vein here. Yeah. So I don't think from this view, you will ever get it undercutting. Like if that were to disappear, that dead wood. Right. It would kind of strange. Then you'd have sort of a strange flow to the trunk but yeah. I don't think it'll ever do that okay so I think you're pretty pretty safe to do that yeah yeah because I can see the live vein in this view Whew. tough decisions like yeah. oh my goodness so yeah we talked about it and uh, we uh, both agree that taking the leader off will be the uh, solution here yeah <laughs> and it's going see. to make you know. A short tree, and I said to Zin, you'll never regret getting taper and movement in a trunk line. It just builds character in the tree. And... Yeah. Okay. Oh, hey, that's what we're going to do. Okay. <laughs> All right. Big cut coming up. <laughs> so, again, I'm going to leave. A yeah, we bit better of leave back. a stub and clean it up next time, eh? Okay, let me take the main leader off okay. first. It's done. Decision time and then action time. Now, I got to stand up. Yeah. <laughs> it's just it's hard. No. Okay. So right underneath the other side. Right about there? I think so. Okay, here I go. Big cut coming up. Okay. All right. Hard part's done. Not much to prune now. Yeah. So a few, 
few more branches. Yeah, I like I like that better. Yeah. Oh yeah, it looks good. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Uh, That's really it's a nice movement to the trunk, isn't it? In that view, yep. it sweeps up. Yeah, that's going to look good then. Do I need to shorten these a bit? I think so. I would yeah. shorten them as much as you comfortably can. I think back here it's good. Because okay. uh, right now there's branches on here and then branches going towards that side. Yeah. I mean, I guess this could work too, but this one's getting a little uh, long, isn't it, between a subdivision? Yeah. There's a note here and then there's a note here. I was thinking, thinking of here, which has a, there's a butt on the top. Yeah. Which will kind of make it go up a bit. Which is, I think it's okay, right? It no, should be, no curve, yeah. I think. yeah. Yeah, I think if you did prune it out to here, I think you're just getting... Too long. Maybe too long there. Yeah, okay. I'm fine with this. Off that All goes. All right. And then... And the same for back there. I don't think you have to touch the one there. Back one bit. That, yeah, that one. This, this one... one yeah. Around there. I go there. <laughs> be on the safe side <laughs> yeah and then i wouldn't touch the apex at all just leave it because you are just gonna want that to thicken up and grow yeah so i think that's it i think you're you're done pruning zen so yeah. let's get to the front view and show the final result front view i think it's uh just through there yeah around there there Okay, let's zoom so it in. shows the back branch, shows the side branch, and then the trunk isn't too too much straightforward, right? Too too long. Yeah, somewhere around somewhere there. Somewhere around there. Yeah, I think that's a charming trunk line. I think it's <laughs> going to look really good. Okay, awesome. perfect. Well, yeah. those are tough decisions, but yeah, I am I am very happy with the result. Though. I, uh, I, I, think I think so. I, I think something to build on in the future. And yeah. Perfect. Yeah. Kind of drastic from where we were. <laughs> where we started, yeah. <laughs> but I, I think we're starting to solve a lot of problems on the tree. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Or have solved them. Yeah. Um, so this is my uh, third tree. It is a Ficus benjamina. And we pruned this uh, last December, I believe. Um, it was around this time. And as you can see, it has grown in a lot. Yeah. And this here was the original front of the tree. Um, we took a look at this and there was a couple problems that we saw one of them was the, the kind of branch these two branches here they're kind of parallel yeah and uh you know basically we we're thinking one needs to go and we were also looking at the uh the structure over here right there because this was the leader it is the leader and then you have this branch coming up and it kind of turns on, a, on an awkward angle and then you know the top kind of goes in it's just uh, it doesn't really flow nicely with the rest of the tree so we were talking about how to solve this problem yeah and you know we talked about taking this whole branch off yeah and uh, you know taking one of these off and when we, were, when we were looking at it this was the most awkward branch we were going to take that off yeah so that I would leave this one but then with this branch off and this back branch off it's nothing over that side of the tree. <laughs> yeah, it's just like emptiness. Yeah, yeah, that was a that that was our another problem that he created. Um, so then, Nigel came with this one. <laughs> he uh, rose the tree. Like, well, this could be a possible friend instead. Yeah, right on the corner here. So, in this case, we were talking about taking off this these these two branches, basically from the base. Yeah, yeah. This will serve as a back branch. This will be our new leader in the front. I'll clean this up, obviously. Yeah. And that solves all our problems because then we have a front branch that's kind of kind of coming towards us, but not straight at us. Yeah. And you have the two sides. You have the back branch. So uh, it seems to solve all the problems. Yeah, we still kind of have sort of the parallel branches here, but I think I think we can lower the one branch and raise the one. All right. So this is more like a trunk line and this is more like a branch. And I think, I think that'll work. Yeah. You, you think so then? I think so. Um, this obviously has to get cut off, right? This is yeah. Yeah. So we keep that one going vertical and the other one more horizontal. And then I think that fixes the, yeah. 
fixes it, doesn't it? One right. becomes a trunk line and the other becomes a branch. Yeah, because right now they're just kind of... Yeah. Yeah. So yeah, I, I think that's... I think that'll work really well. <laughs> so I'm going to move this marker yeah. to the new, new front. front right about there. A new tree, a new day, a yeah. new front. Awesome. <laughs> All right, so Zinn has trusted me with the pruning of this tree. <laughs> He's putting me to work, which is, that's good. So, yeah, let's do the major cuts first. So this, we were going to take this one right off because it kind of, yeah, it grows in a strange direction. Yep. So here I go. I'm going to, we don't have to worry about dieback on these. They're pretty reliable. So here I go with the cut. Another big cut. Yeah, oh, it goes. it's done. And that should heal pretty nicely. I'll clean up this stub here. Like that. Let's check the front. How's it looking? Looking pretty good, I think. Yeah, I think so. So we'll switch to the scissors now. So this one, we wanted to kind of keep vertical. So I'm going to take off this lower branch here. Like that. Um, this one was going to be more of a horizontal branch. Yeah. I'll bring that down probably with a guy wire, you think? And I think I should shorten it. I've got a, a division yeah. here so I can take the tip off. Sure. Like that. And this one too. We've got a division here so I can take the straight part off. Eh? Like that. Just making it more compact and yeah. then guy wire it down. Yeah. Um, this one, I think we've got a lot happening. There's a division here which is nice it flows these ones are kind of coming 90 degrees to the the branch line so i don't know if i'd want to shorten it back to those i think we keep this one and take these ones off is my feeling yep yeah i agree these I'll are kind of i'll take this old leaf off here yeah they're kind of like yeah well we'll keep the uh the flow keep line this the, here yeah all right i think so done <laughs> just like that just like that okay so that's kind of got that now there is the possibility of shortening that one because you've got a branch here and one here which mm, yeah tough to say if you want it it's it's very straight that's the only problem right um, I'd say long term that's probably the better thing to do is cut the tip off and then develop these yeah, out ones. yeah you do want to eventually kind of grow it up into the canopy here yeah but, we'll give it some movement but um yeah i don't know what do you think zen um i think the back one's not the greatest flow is it not the greatest direction either yeah maybe just take that back one off and keep these keep two. the front yeah yeah let's do that eh? okay give that a go like that i think that's good yeah so these will come on yeah, this will kind of fill in out here. Yeah. This okay. one out front, um, I don't think we want it that long. Yeah, we'll, uh, we'll have to shorten this. I would take it back to this one. To that one? So we'll go more to the right. Yeah. Yeah, okay. That okay? I agree with that, yes. Okay. There we yeah. go. Now this one may come off in the future, but you might want it just something to break up that smooth trunk line <laughs> yeah yeah you don't want to see the trunk from top to bottom which you're kind of seeing now but <laughs> it'll it'll fill in yeah uh there's a stub here i can clean up um on this branch we've got there's the obvious you know this thing here yeah just going into the tree that one's definitely going to come off yeah the one on the outside's all right that one's fine I think this one needs to be shortened. We've got a good, should shorten it to that fanning out branch. Yeah, think? cause that'll kind of make the flow going, start going out, outwards. Okay, so that comes off here. Yep, looks like a good angle too. Yeah, it's nice, it Very, flows nice, doesn't yes, it? Flows. it? Creates that weeping, yep. they do call these the weeping figs. So <laughs> we'll make it weep. Yep. Um, There's something strange happening here. We've got this branch and this one kind of interfere. 
Uh, this one's very straight and it kind of comes from the inside of a curve here. My gut instinct tells me to take that one off. So if that comes off... Does it look too empty? Uh, I think it's okay because we have this in the front. Yeah. So, you know, I mean this literally from the front it looks like it's just it's a longer branch of that. <laughs> yeah. I, so when that comes off, it's not a very interesting branch. It's very yeah. straight and it's. Do you see how it sort of looks oh, like it yeah. comes from the inside of a curve? Yeah, like it's from this angle, it just looks looks terrible. Like okay, so it's, that's so straight, and this is like another type yeah, of thing. That yeah, that one's got movement and taper. You can so, go off it goes. Off it goes. Off it goes. <laughs> there. There we go. Okay. And I think there's a little work up top now, so. We're going to follow these branches. This is fine. That looks good. That looks good. We're coming up here. We've got staggering branches. Um, I would say it's getting a little tall. It is getting a little We could take it tall. <laughs> to there, maybe. It's kind of going a weird direction, though. Yeah. Um, I was looking at this back here i mean okay yeah it's, it's kind of got that same thing where it, it comes the, the branch comes on the inside instead of the going to the opposite so direction to prune it right here i was thinking that too yeah because right. then we have the other one going to the back yeah yeah Good call then yeah yeah that looks much better. better yeah it's just a little long here in the apex isn't it we could reduce it um I'm just trying to see where Take that stub off here. Maybe because there's one, there's a branch right there going towards the front. There's one, it's just a tip for now, maybe. We've got two parallel branches here. Oh, those, yeah. I'm gonna solve that. Um, maybe, yeah, uh, I think. There? Yeah, because this, that. And then also this one here. Yeah. Uh, it's eventually just going to be parallels. So I guess we'll have to. I uh, think make this the trunk line and this a branch by. Like that. And up there, you think? Sorry, you can't really see it. Yeah, that could work. I yeah. think so because then you have this as a branch, and then that's that that's my main line going upwards. Okay. I think so. Yes. All right. Here we go. This is a fairly big cut, coming up. There just we like go. That. Yeah, I think that's more, more, much better. That's a bit cleaner. Pretty good looking tree, isn't it? Yeah, it's got a nice basic structure to it. And the structure is uh, is what's important at this stage, I would think. Yeah, all I think these, of that structure, you know. All these primary branches, because they're gonna thicken up and thicken up. And, <laughs> and there's no correcting much up there unless you do really drastic pruning. But yeah, I think that's looking good. Okay. Now you wanted to repot this too. I, I do. Um, do you mind lifting the uh, the pot so we can see what's underneath? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, I just yeah. discovered the uh, amount of stuff coming out of the uh, the pot. I mean, this this is a root. It looks like a rubber band, but it's a root. <laughs> okay. <laughs> it goes out one drainage hole and in, in another. Yeah. It's been in this pot for a uh, year and a half to two years now, so I think okay. it's a good time to get it out. Yeah. Oh, it won't hurt to do a bit of root work on it and get it. Yeah. Maybe even expose some surface roots. Who knows? We'll see. That'd be cool. And you know these roots here. Yeah. Uh, I remember you mentioned in one of the videos that a week after you bring them indoors from uh, the fall weather, oh, yeah, it yeah. Cr creates that humidity. Yeah. That's when these grew. These whole uh -huh, new ones. Okay. But I was I was like, why is it coming out with so many roots? Like I, my house is dry. You know, it's not that humid. And I was wondering about that. And then you had a video, and I was like, oh, that makes sense. Awesome. That's what happened. Yeah. Yeah could be the drop in light to yeah stimulates root growth or something yeah. something could happen yeah something. <laughs> it might do it every year when I bring them in they drop aerial roots and they start yeah doing cool things okay well let's uh you've got a pot for it don't you I do it's, All right. uh, it's beside me it's okay <laughs> um this was the front here wasn't it yeah somewhere there somewhere Like that. So it's a pretty balanced tree. You know, it doesn't look to me. It doesn't look heavier on one side than the other. So we just so it straight up. I would, because the trunk sweeps a bit this way, I would plant it slightly that way. Sure. Just like that. Offset. Just here's center. Off. Just offset. about there. And 
I put it right smack dab in the middle of the pot. I don't think you need to go back further or anything like that. Sure. And vertical like that, I think that's... Yeah, that, that looks, looks good. good. Looks good to me. And I, I would say, uh, what I would do is I would plant it about that height, so the roots are just above the lip of the pot, and then I'd mound your soil up a bit around it. And then in the future, once it's growing really well, just rake away some of that surface soil and you can expose those surface roots a bit. Right. Like maybe in the summer or something. Okay. Okay. Yeah. So uh, we'll start with the base layer. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, you want to set your here? Yeah. Yeah. yeah, of course. Yeah, that's exciting getting in, in a pot. And then you just move some of the stuff. Okay, so we uh, finished repotting the tree. It took us about uh, half an hour or so. And as you can see, it looks pretty nice, I think. Um, this is the new pot that I got recently. It's a shipment from uh, China. <laughs> and um, the tree is slightly potted, potted to the left from the center of the pot. And also about the center from the, uh, the side, the, you know, the side look. Um, so that would be it for this tree. Uh, hopefully it'll grow and you know, fill, fill up. And I think uh, we think it looks pretty nice, yes? I do. I, I think it has a nice, pleasing, basic structure to it. And I think it's just something, as it starts filling in, it'll look really tropical and really nice. Yep. So that'll be the end of this tree. Um, I think this is the last tree of the day. We got through three three trees. Yeah. A tree off. Yep. And yeah, this one had the most, uh, it got chopped on the roots and the other ones got chopped on the top. And <laughs> Yeah, this one had a pretty fair, um, heavy root pruning. Yeah, but I, I think he's got those roots sorted out really nicely. He's in. I think that's set it up for the future. And as I said, five years from now, that's going to be in the <laughs> KW show. Yeah, that's a promise, right? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Thanks for coming over today, Zen. It was great having you down, and I really enjoyed it. Yeah, well, thanks for having me. You pay for lunch. You know, that's... Very nice of you. <laughs> I'll have to choose you next time. <laughs> All right.